If you sat down on paper and you tried to plan out what do we need at a university, I don't think you could make a bullet item that said build a family or build a community. I think that's something that happens when you have a group of people who are really passionate about the work they do and want to see everyone grow and succeed. It's more than just a university, it's actually an entire community. If it wasn't for Harrisburg University, I would not be the adult I am today. Because of Harrisburg University. Because of Harrisburg University. I am becoming successful. I am geeky. If it wasn't for Harrisburg University, I wouldn't have a clue what I was going to do for the rest of my life. Today, I'm successful because of Harrisburg University. I'm originally from Baltimore, Maryland. Um, when I heard about Harrisburg University from my guidance counselor, I was worried because my GPA was only uh, a 2.45, which some people might look at that and say, well, it's a C. You know, it's, you did average. So uh, with average, I'm going to an average school with an average degree, um, and then I'm going to have an average job making average money. And to be brutally honest about it, money is a big factor for me growing up with none. So uh, I knew that I had to do something very drastic, very exceptional. One of the things here at Harrisburg University is this idea of sort of finding students that are looked over by other schools. When they get here, what we're finding is, because of the way we nurture them, because of the size of our classes, because of the peer structure that we have here at the university, that some of those students are flourishing. They're growing well beyond the dreams that they have for themselves. Our mission statement is geared to those students that come in with potential and then follow through with that potential and end up succeeding because they have that potential. I didn't like school that much, so I didn't really have the push to, to go to college. And I'm doing really well now. Like I've been on the dean's list for the past two years, and I just feel like there would have been a lot of like stones that would have been left unturned if I didn't come here. I got into Duquesne and I got into Penn State, and I chose to come here. Um, when you go to those campuses, you are a number, but here it's really that one-on-one -on -one relationship, that tight-knit family, where everybody who walks in walks out succeeding. A lot of professors, they become your friends, sometimes like family members. I think it all starts with an open mind coming into university, wanting to study, wanting to get an education. And the professors are here to make sure you succeed at that. They don't see you as a number or a prophet. They see you as another individual who's hungry to learn, who wants to achieve something out of life and make something of themselves. If it wasn't for Hazard University, I would not be successful today. The thing I noticed that was different from the other colleges I applied to was that you get a lot of real world experience here, which is really awesome for me because I'm a learn by doing kind of person. We put a lot of emphasis on experiential learning, on problem solving. I think both of these are hugely beneficial to students that are getting ready to go out in the workforce. I am working with uh, the professor of biotechnology on an independent research project that I formulated on my own. Uh, that aims to develop a biomaterial that can be injected into the spine to stimulate regeneration. It is rare to design your own research project and have a professor from start to finish to have an ultimate goal of publishing. That's amazing. As a senior, I've started looking at job postings and a lot of them say minimum of two years experience because of Harrisburg University. I'm comfortable because I know that I have that. Because of Harrisburg University, I'm well-rounded and more diverse as a person. I'm from Pittsburgh, which is probably farther out west in Pennsylvania. You have some kids from Philadelphia, a lot of kids from New Jersey. I'm originally from San Diego, California. In eastern part of Nepal. I'm originally from Montreal. I'm from India. Lancaster City. I was born and raised in New York. We're attracting a type of student that in some cases would never have the opportunity to go to college. And we're putting before them careers and opportunities that they may never have had access to in the past. If you ask my students, uh, I, would, I usually tell them that Harrisburg University runs on girl power because at least most of the classes that I teach are mostly women. 
It's fantastic to watch and see what happens in the life sciences around this building. Those young women who are sitting in those classrooms are going to be the leaders in their particular fields of study. And that's just been fantastic to see. I am originally from the island of Jamaica, born and raised. I came here when I was 12 and Harrisburg University changed my entire plan of where I wanted to be in the future. I did not see myself getting to be a sophomore in college at all, so yeah. As we see ourselves grow, we're really gonna see ourselves being influential, not just in our students' lives, but also in the lives of the community as well. If you look at the school, it's helping the society here, helping this underserved uh, population. You know, right across the bridge, we have two very, very kind of poor neighborhoods. You have kids who don't know what they're doing in life. Harrisburg University is accepting people that are ambitious, that care, that want to see better for the world and for the community around them. Am I the same person as when I first walked in? No, I've, I've matured and grown a lot more and I give that credit to the professors that I've been working with. They've molded me into a better person. I acclimate everything that I'm doing today to them. If it wasn't for Harrisburg University, I would be stuck in Baltimore City. Because of Harrisburg University, I am a better person. If it wasn't for Harrisburg U, I'd probably be struggling to keep my grades up. Because of Harrisburg University, I'm successful. If it wasn't for Harrisburg University, I wouldn't have discovered my passion for working hard. Because of Harrisburg University, I am a graduate. I'm ready for whatever they throw at me. Because of Harrisburg University, I'm finally able to become that above average person that I've always, always felt I've been destined to be in life.